Welcome to AndroidVideoReview.net's special presentation. Right now you're taking a look at my Motorola Droid X which usually runs Android's gingerbread but as you can see I'm currently not well I currently am running uh, Android still but through a website set up by Microsoft I'm using a Windows 7 uh, Windows Phone 7 emulator which allows me to test out Windows Phone 7 on my Android device to see what I'm quote unquote missing out on uh, and you know it's actually really cool how they've done this I gotta say this is the first time I've seen anything like this and uh, you know my Droid X I know Motorola probably does have I'm, I'm not positive have Windows Phone 7 devices but I know like Samsung with uh, the Galaxy devices, comparable phones, they have uh, devices that run Windows Phone, so this might be more relevant to those people, I guess. Or uh, in, in any case, it gives you a chance to see what Windows Phone 7 looks like, and they're trying to convert you away from Android. I'm guessing eventually iOS will also have a similar, a similar em, uh, emulator. Uh, the website to get this, or, or how you get this running, is just go onto your browser and type in... Uh, let me see the address. It's uh, http colon backslash backslash aka dot ms slash wp demo and that'll it'll ask you there'll be a prompt if you wanna basically run this and then you're ready to go and this looks and feels exactly like Windows 7 you can do you know with the tiles you can go side to side back and forth once you click on each thing, there you have kind of like demo setups. So I'll show you. It's a phone. Uh, see, illicit. I can go up and down, which is really cool. These are all fictitious names and numbers and times. It's asking me to select Michelle Alexander, and it's actually bringing me into call. But I don't. I don't think it's when I put it up to my ear. I don't actually hear anything. So I think it's just visual. Um, it disables some of the features also that you can click on. So down there, you can hit the Windows button. End call doesn't work. This will bring you back. Then it gives you the option of thanks you uh, for trying that feature. You can share it. You can check phones, or I'm going to return to start. Uh, you can go to messaging, scroll through, see how it looks. And it's telling me to uh, that I can slide. It's giving me a gesture. You can see I can slide through, I guess, tiles or windows. I don't know what you would even call that. Um, and basically slide back. And scroll up and down. It's telling me to select again, Michelle Alexander. Now I'm seeing a text line. I can hit back. Text mobile. And it's giving you a pretty comprehensive run through. Again, that was that. Now, people. Michelle Alexander. And I could like her status right there. Go back. Check out all accounts. I can go to Facebook. Michelle Alexander. Swipe to the side. Swipe to the side again. Swipe to the side. And then I'm there. What else do we have? I mean, it's pretty cool. Uh, it shows you really how it works, which I like. It shows you how Outlook looks on Windows 7. Click on More. And you can hit link in inboxes. You can link your Hotmail, which is kind of funny that not many people, uh, I don't know many people that use Hotmail still, but you can select your Gmail over there, which is pretty interesting. And you can look at your LinkedIn box and check a, an email out. It's on Reddit, it gives you your photo. It's really, I like the design, it's very clean. I don't know if every device is like this or if there's skins that manufacturers put on top of Windows Phone 7 but uh, I'm actually pleasantly surprised I'm not going to drop my Android phone now but uh, whereas I wouldn't really consider Windows uh, Phone 7 at all now it might be worth taking a look at uh, you know for other devices go through everything get to do list it just seems like everything is very integrated into Windows Phone 7 like Whereas in Android, you have a lot of apps that you can get to do a lot of things. Windows Phone 7, especially because it syncs with Outlook, just, I, I guess it's like how Android has, syncs a lot with the Google services. Uh, it's helpful 
Windows Phone 7 has pretty good integration with obviously the Windows products, the Microsoft products. And you go through and then different stuff. And that's basically for the most part. Here's pictures. Yeah, let me select this. And you actually see the picture. Hit more. You share it around Facebook. So it's got all the different integration and you can tag the faces. And that's pretty much it. So I think it's definitely a, a cool thing. If you got five minutes, you want to waste some time, see what Windows Phone 7 looks like, definitely check it out. Uh, it's just very, uh, I'm surprised how smooth it runs, even with like a poor internet connection. Uh, it's just because I have Wi Fi here, but it's, it's very slow, my Wi Fi. And it, it's pretty speedy and uh, it's fluid and it looks a